Welcome, everyone, from the desert, bringing you Desert Faith at DesertBedrock.com. Let's begin as we begin all things holy. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. The following is an excerpt from the Divine Office, also known as the Liturgy of the Hours. The second reading that is taken from the Office of Readings. From the Treatise on the Psalms by Saint Hilary, Bishop. The Meaning of the Fear of the Lord. Blessed are those who fear the Lord, who walk in His ways. Notice that when Scripture speaks of the fear of the Lord, it does not leave the phrase in isolation as if it were a complete summary of faith. No, many things are added to it or are presupposed by it. From these, we may learn its meaning and excellence. In the book of Proverbs, Solomon tells us, If you cry out for wisdom and raise your voice for understanding, if you look for it as for silver and search for it as for treasure, then you will understand the fear of the Lord. We see here the difficult journey we must undertake before we can arrive at the fear of the Lord. We must begin by crying out for wisdom. We must hand over to our intellect the duty of making every decision. We must look for wisdom and search for it. Then we must understand the fear of the Lord. The ways of the Lord are many, though He is Himself the way. When He speaks of Himself, He calls Himself the way. and shows us the reason why he called himself the way. No one can come to the Father except through me.
we must ask for these many ways to find the one that is good, that is, we shall find the one way of eternal life through the guidance of many teachers. These ways are found in the law. in the prophets, in the gospels, in the writings of the apostles, in the different good works by which we fulfill the commandments. Blessed are those who walk these ways in the fear of the Lord. From the Desert With Desert Faith This message has been delivered to you individually and collectively each and every syllable, word, and sentence, all in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. In nomine Patris et Fili et Spiritus Sancti. Amen.